step into the cosmos of 1,979 Seconds The Black Hole, a film that has carved its place in cinematic history. What enduring qualities transform this space odyssey into an everlasting symbol of the industry? As you reflect, consider the classic Hollywood actors who graced the screen, each contributing to the film's enduring allure. Share your favorite and let the memories of their performances linger. Now, let's journey into the intriguing facets of this cinematic gem. Did you know that the black hole marked Disney's foray into the realm of science fiction? It's a fascinating departure from the studio's traditional fare, blending futuristic visions with timeless storytelling. The movie's special effects, ahead of its time, captivated audiences, while its exploration of existential themes added depth to the narrative. As you reminisce about the black hole, what's your most cherished memory or personal experience tied to this cosmic adventure? We invite you to share your stories and recollections in the comments below. Your unique perspective adds another layer to the ongoing legacy of this iconic film. So, whether you're drawn to the gravitational pull of the unknown or captivated by the stellar performances, the black hole continues to resonate. Share your thoughts and let's embark on this journey through the cosmos of cinema together. What enduring qualities do you think make this movie an everlasting symbol of the industry? Or, perhaps, which classic Hollywood actor in this movie was your favorite? We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. The Black Hole, released in 1979, directed by Gary Nelson, is a landmark science fiction film that explores the mysteries of a massive black hole at the edge of the universe. The story follows the crew of the spaceship Us Palomino, who discover the long-lost us Cygnus, hovering dangerously close to the black hole. Led by the enigmatic Dr. Hans Reinhardt, the Cygnus crew appears devoted to exploring the secrets of the black hole. But as the Palomino team delves deeper, they uncover dark and unsettling truths about Reinhardt's motivations and the ominous forces at play. The film is notable for its cutting-edge visual effects, including groundbreaking use of computer-generated imagery at the time. The characters, such as the iconic robot duo Vincent and Maximilian, contribute to the film's lasting impact on popular culture. Despite a mixed critical reception, The Black Hole remains a significant entry in the sci-fi genre, influencing subsequent space-themed films and leaving a lasting impression on audiences with its thought-provoking narrative and captivating visuals. Its exploration of existential themes and the unknown has solidified its place as a classic in the realm of science fiction cinema. The Black Hole, a 1979 sci-fi film, marked the end of an era in special effects production. It was the final significant project created entirely within the Disney studio under the old studio system. Unlike modern productions, the film's elaborate special effects, including the visually stunning Black Hole, were crafted in-house, without outsourcing to external companies. The creation of the Black Hole effect itself is noteworthy. The visual spectacle was achieved by forming a whirlpool in a round plexiglass water tank and adding various colors of paint. This practical approach to visual effects, though a departure from contemporary CGI, contributed to the film's unique and captivating portrayal of the mysterious cosmic phenomenon. Interestingly, the film faced challenges beyond its visual elements. Alan Dean Foster, the author of the film's novelization, expressed serious concerns about the script's scientific accuracy. Appalled by what he perceived as bad science, Foster compiled a list of suggested changes to enhance the storyline. This led to a meeting among Disney executives, highlighting the significance of scientific authenticity even in a fictional narrative. In retrospect, The Black Hole remains a cinematic milestone, not just for its narrative exploration of a massive black hole, but also for its role in the evolution of special effects production. As the last major film produced under the traditional studio system, it stands as a testament to Disney's commitment to in-house creativity and innovation. Dr. Reinhardt's ship, initially named the Centaurus, underwent a significant change before The Black Hole's production began. It was later renamed Cygnus, drawing inspiration from the constellation where the first known black hole was discovered in 1964. 
This adjustment reflects a subtle nod to real-world astronomical discoveries, underscoring the film's commitment to intertwining science fiction with scientific elements. The decision to align the ship's name with a celestial reference adds a layer of authenticity to the movie's cosmic narrative, subtly connecting it to the mysteries of the universe. Interestingly, this astronomical connection extends beyond the black hole's immediate context. The movie's poster finds an unexpected cameo in Sam Flynn's bedroom in the opening scene of Tron, Legacy. This cross-referencing of iconic visuals across distinct sci-fi universes showcases the lasting impact of the black hole on popular culture. It's a testament to the film's enduring influence that reaches beyond its initial release in 1979, resonating with filmmakers and audiences in unexpected ways. These subtle details, from renaming the spaceship to unexpected appearances in later films, contribute to the layered and lasting legacy of the black hole. They highlight how seemingly small decisions in the production process can ripple through time, leaving an indelible mark on the cinematic landscape. In essence, the black hole's significance transcends its role as a standalone 1979 movie. It's a celestial imprint on the tapestry of science fiction cinema. Harlan Ellison, a brief consultant on the black hole, stirred controversy on the film set. Fired after just one morning, he allegedly proposed an adult animated film featuring Disney characters, an idea that didn't sit well with Disney executives. Despite Ellison's claim of it being a joke, his abrupt dismissal added an unexpected twist to the movie's behind-the-scenes drama. This incident sheds light on the challenges faced during the production, hinting at a clash of creative visions and the length studios go to maintain a family-friendly image. The Black Hole's journey from script to screen was not without its share of unexpected plot twists, both on and off camera. The Black Hole, a 1979 Disney sci-fi venture, holds a distinct position in the company's history. At the time, it ranked among Disney's most costly productions, marking a departure from their typical family-friendly fare. Surprisingly, despite its ambitious budget, the film became one of Disney's most expensive failures. This financial setback signaled a shift in the studio's approach to filmmaking. Notably, The Black Hole earned the distinction of being Disney's inaugural PG-rated movie, deviating from their usual G-rated offerings. This departure reflected the film's darker and more complex themes, a departure from Disney's traditional storytelling. The decision to embrace a more mature rating underscored the film's ambition to explore nuanced and thought-provoking narratives within the sci-fi genre. As the production unfolded, not all challenges were confined to the creative realm. During a storm scene set in the greenhouse, actor Robert Forster sustained a minor head injury. This real-life incident added an unexpected layer of tension to the film's creation, emphasizing the physical risks involved in bringing the cosmic narrative to life. In hindsight, the combination of significant financial investment, a departure from the family-friendly norm, and on-set challenges marked the black hole as a pivotal moment in Disney's cinematic journey. The film's complex legacy lies not only in its exploration of cosmic mysteries, but also in the studio's willingness to take creative and financial risks, signaling a new era for Disney in the realm of science fiction cinema. As we bid adieu to the captivating journey through the cosmic depths of the black hole, let the celestial echoes linger in your thoughts. This 1979 masterpiece isn't just a cinematic voyage, it's a portal to introspection, a tether between the realms of science and fiction. The swirling enigma of the black hole mirrors the complexities within you's uncharted territories waiting to be explored. Now, as the credits roll and the echoes of Vincent and B.O.B.'s banter resonate, take a moment. Reflect on the gravitational pull of this film on your own universe. Did it ignite a fascination for the mysteries of the cosmos? Perhaps it stirred a nostalgia for a bygone era of sci-fi wonder. Share your cosmic revelations, your interstellar musings, in the comments below. The Black Hole isn't merely a movie, it's a shared experience, a constellation of memories etched in the fabric of time. Your stories, your cosmic connections, are the nebulae that make this universe of fandom vibrant and ever-expanding. Thank you for joining us on this intergalactic odyssey through memory and cinema. Your thoughts are the pulsars that keep the spirit of the black hole alive. Until we rendezvous in the next celestial adventure, keep exploring the infinite frontiers of your imagination. May your memories of the black hole continue to shimmer like stars in the cosmic expanse.